So what we're doing is right now the way that the cut out, the, the way that the pit is, I guess, the water in and out of the pit. There's a little bit of inflow on the south side of the pit, and then on the north side, over by your property, there's a there's an alluvial material we call it. It's like gravel, and that's where the water leaves the pit. So we're building a wall, and it's a permit requirement that we do this. It's basically an underground dam. It's 2,000 feet long, and it goes 80 feet deep. And so that's why you're seeing the activity right now is because they're prepping all that area to put that cutoff wall in. They'll be trenching the cutoff wall in this year, and then next year we'll actually go deeper and kind of crush a grout down near the bedrock. Um, so that's the activity that you're seeing in all the construction vehicles. Next summer we'll be building the water treatment facility. Um, but then after after the construction's done, it would be if the if the um, operators. I'm not sure which route they're planning to use, if it's around the pit or that road, but it would be, you know, just the operators going to work is what it would be pretty much. And light vehicles, it would be pickup trucks. So, as long as you understand one thing here, the use of that road is a, by you is an inconvenience to me. Not me using that road be an inconvenience to you. Understood. And I agree with that. I think no it's problem earlier, not actually a problem, but right. Because I use that a little bit. I think it's a good idea, like Matt said, to sit down and talk about it some more, definitely.